we are so excited about the Institute for Integrated Science and Society. It's a, a new way of doing research, new way of teaching, new way of learning that brings together students and faculty from so many different disciplines, the scientists, the physicists and chemists and mathematicians with engineers to collaborate to solve these enduring problems. And we're also bringing together uh, the Shea Center for Entrepreneurship and to try to find things that can be brought out into the world and create new opportunities. And that alone is exciting, but now when you add in the humanities, you add in the English and, and, and philosophy and theology and, and history, you bring on yet another perspective of what has mattered to people in all walks of life around the world. That can be uniquely brought by all these diverse perspectives and connected throughout the school in a way that this isn't some institute off on the side. It is integrated deeply within every part of the school. What we've seen at Apple and, and I think what BC really embraces is this integration of, of science, technology, and humanities mm -hmm. to not only ask how do we solve something, but does it matter? Will it help people? Will it change lives? And I think that's one of the hallmarks of what makes BC so great service to others. And that's what I love about Apple. That's what I love about Boston College. What I hope for the future for the Schiller Institute is that there'll just be this continued history of students wanting to come to BC to be involved in whatever the current day problem is and just this continuous uh, momentum of new students coming and taking their knowledge out into the world. It's very important to us that this institute not only evolve an, a new methodology for learning, but it tackles problems that matter to all of us around the world. And focusing on areas such as energy, health, and the environment are critically important to everyone. And if you add to that, that this is about how it matters in society, you can just think of the incredible opportunities passionate students are going to have to make a difference in the world. I hope years from now, there are going to be some amazing future world leaders who came from BC and came from this institute because they learned the process of bringing together diverse perspectives to solve important problems that matter to people. And that will happen here at BC and it will continue in their lives as they graduate and move on into their careers. And they continue to do that wherever they are, both here in Massachusetts and around the world in communities that are desperately in need of, of help from all of us. So growing up, one of our sons would always say, why is it when I leave a school, it gets even better? And I said, it's because of the experience people have at the school that they want to make it even better. And Philip had a great experience at BC, and this is one of our ways of making it even better for the next generation. In the end, it's going to create students that are so smart and talented and driven and passionate and all in the hopes of benefiting mankind and being of service to others, which is the core mission of the school. So it's really about the core values and missions of BC applied to science, technology, the humanities, and solving problems that matter to us all. I mean, what can't be more exciting than that? I mean, that's thrilling.